please subscribe Sporta TV for more information, MotoGP and Formula 1 2023. It was a cruel irony that Marc Marquez was absent for Honda's first MotoGP win in two years. But, team manager Alberto Puig has insisted that their injured star rider should be emboldened by Alex Rins' victory at the MotoGP Grand Prix of the Americas. Marquez has been critical of Honda's development but, as he sat at home recovering from an injury caused by his own crash, Puig took the opportunity to remind him that there is hope. Marquez crashed three laps into the first Grand Prix of 2023, inflicting a hand injury on himself which required surgery and ruled him out of the next two rounds. It is already a bitter blow to his hopes of winning a seventh Premier Class Championship this season, and he currently sits 57 points behind leader Marco Bezzecchi in the MotoGP standings. He hopes to return for the Spanish MotoGP at Jerez on April 30th, but it is no guarantee. We must take note and be satisfied with the evolution that the bike has made in a few races. The results of this weekend will surely have pleased him. We still need to improve the bike, but the potential is there. Mark continues to follow the plan set by his doctors and is making progress. He will do another check before the Spanish GP to check the situation of the hand bone. LCR Honda rider Rins won at Coda after a costly fall from Francesco Bagnaia who looked certain to win. It was a huge moment for a team who endured an awful 2022, and even failed to score a single point at a Premier Class race for the first time in 40 years last year in Germany. Joan Mir, Marquez's Repsol Honda teammate, failed to finish a race for the third time this season. It was a stark contrast for the 2020 MotoGP champion to his ex-Suzuki teammate Rins. The final, and crucial, message of this weekend is that the hard work of everyone in Japan and Europe is paying off, Quig insisted. Everyone in HRC is giving their best to get back on top. Thanks to Rins, we were able to get the reward of victory and show that we are still here, that we are still competing. We at HRC believe that his potential is at least equal to that of Rins, because they raced together in the same team for many years and you saw the results. On the other hand, Alex Marquez injured his leg in the impact of his collision with Jorge Martin at the MotoGP Grand Prix of the Americas, but he doesn't expect to miss a race. The Grazzini Ducati rider has confirmed a problem to his quadriceps. The Spanish MotoGP, his home race, is on April 30th. Marquez's exciting start to life at Ducati was brought back down to earth when his Grand Prix was ended on Sunday by a fellow satellite Ducati rider, Martin. It has been seen with the ultrasound that, after the impact on Sunday, there is muscle rupture of the vastus lateralis of the quadriceps and distension of the ligament, he said. It's not going to stop me from competing, but these days we have to lower the level of training to recover in the face of Harris. It's something that can happen to me tomorrow. It has happened in the past, will happen in the present and will happen again in the future. So I accept he's sorry, and that's it. For me, it's closed. It's racing. On the other hand, the Portuguese rider was wiped out of a podium position on the third lap of last month's opening round of the 2023 season at the Algarve International Circuit. Oliveira suffered tendon damage on his right side as a result of the heavy hit and was forced to miss the Argentina GP the following week. The RNF rider was cleared to race at the Circuit of the Americas and managed to score points in both the Sprint and the Grand Prix. Building on his eighth in the sprint, Oliveira took the checkered flag just over a second behind factory Aprilia counterpart Maverick Vinales in the Grand Prix in fifth. Commenting on his race last Sunday, Oliveira said, it was not too bad. It was a tough day because it was so easy to crash that I was really happy to just stay on the bike and really be competitive. Oliveira says he struggled with his tendon injury, but it really didn't make that much of a difference to him as his entire body was in pain after a physically demanding weekend at Coda. It was really a small victory after coming back from an injury and on a track which I really don't like. To finish fifth is a good result. Injury, it was there, but to be honest I had so much pain all over the body that it was just another one, he said.